to build this type of robots we generally need all these components and already know a motor driver some sensors motors and some jumpers personally i do not like to use these jumpers because these jumpers are very bad they get loose connections after rapid use of them sometimes we don't even know and they already get break internally and this is irritating when we do all connections and program correctly but still things does not work properly yes of course we can find out a faulty jumper just by using multimeter but still it is not sure you can't say that when it will be lose its contact again so to eliminate this problem and save time to build robotic project i designed the basic robot shield let's make it and see how to use it one thing before starting the video if you are new to my channel click this red subscribe button to stay connected with me if you look at the shield it has very simple look just have a l293d dual edge bridge motor driver ic on it and some male female header pins which can be used for interfacing sensors and servo motors with it for more details of this shield check out my patreon page link is given in description for that now let's see how you can make this shield by yourself we also build a bluetooth controlled rc car using this shield I order PCB for this shield from the pcb.com who also the sponsor of this video. They provide high quality PCB at affordable price. 10 PCB is for just $5 with super fast build time of minimum 24 hours and currently they are offering welcome bonus of $5. That means you can get your first PCB almost free from PCB way. Okay, now solder all components on PCB. Insert L293D IC in its socket. Now let's build a simple robot body using all these components. Now connect left motor in M2 screw terminal and right motor in M1 screw terminal. Insert Bluetooth module in V1 socket, connect battery and all done. Wait, wait, wait. I think something is missing here. What? Yep, we did not program this bot yet. So to program this bot, connect Arduino to the PC using USB cable. Open the given code and simply upload it to the Arduino by selecting correct COM port and board type. Note one thing before uploading the program. Disconnect battery and remove the Bluetooth module and upload it. Download link for code and all other stuff is given in the video description below. Now it's time to make remote control for this. To do it just get your phone and go to play store. Install the application by name car bluetooth rc. After installation it's time to pair your phone with bluetooth module. To do this connect the battery to the board. You will see red led blinking on bluetooth module. It means hc05 is ready to pair. Now go to the bluetooth settings of your phone. Search for new device and you will see HC05 or something like this. Just click on that. If it will ask for password, enter 1234 or 4 times 0. It is the default password for HC05 Bluetooth module. Now open the app which we installed before. Click on the play button and select HC05 from the drop down list. As it connect with phone, the red LED on module will blink slower. Now it's ready to play.
well thanks for watching hope you guys find this video useful if yes like it share it comment down your doubts and for more such videos do subscribe to the channel